National University of Singapore is a leading global university centred in Asia. Its School of Computing was established in 1998 to provide a stimulating learning environment with a faculty staff of over 200. Paul Maritz, CEO of VMware, paid a visit to the NUS School of Computing to share his thoughts and views on cloud computing. What I'm actually going to do today is, is really actually pose more questions than answers. Uh, because I think we're actually uh, entering into a new phase of the computer industry where the basic paradigms are, of computing change. And that happens sort of every 20 to 30 years. You know, we went from the sort of mainframe era, then we went into the client server era, of which the internet is a particular instantiation. But now we're going into another era uh, where the way that our computing capability is produced and consumed is going to fundamentally change. Because we have to take the legacy applications with us on this journey, virtualization is actually a technology that put legacy applications on a journey because when you virtualize what you're doing is you're encapsulating an existing application and all of the complexity around it, even the operating system, putting it in a black box and allowing you to treat that as basically a unitary load that can be spread across new infrastructure. If this is the case that the traditional functions of the operating system are being taken over by this new coordinating layer underneath it and increasingly the abstracted services for applications are being provided by the new programming frameworks, by and large nobody writes to the Windows and Linux APIs anymore. It's a good question to ask why do we even have an operating system? Because if information is becoming the new currency, and you use that analogy, the obvious question is, obvious question is, are we going to keep it under our mattresses, just, which is, the, you know, keeping your information in a device is the equivalent of putting your money under your mattress? Or are we going to put it in banks? <laughs> and the reason we put money in banks is, first of all, for protection. Secondly, convenient access, because wherever you can go, we can use an ATM to access it. Thirdly, we put it in a bank because value can be added to it once it's in the bank. I think Paul did two things with his speech. He told us about the new paradigm shift with the move to the cloud, and as well as the opportunities from the fact that he was talking about more questions than answers, I think. So he was about talking about the opportunities available to, to students and to people who are going out into industry. So I think that on that point, it was a very interesting, interesting talk. VMware works with global higher education institutions to arm graduates with the right skill sets for their future through its education program. The only question is, are you ready to start your journey?